This salmon poke bowl is my take on this hip Hawaiian dish. It's delicious, nutritious, and best of all, super fast and easy to make. Every good poke bowl starts off with rice. You could use any rice that you want, but I like sushi rice because it's a short grain and it's really sticky. If you're really short of time, just heat up some microwave packet stuff. Easy peasy. But cooking rice from scratch is in my DNA. My granddad was a rice farmer, and if we didn't know how to cook rice, by the age of about seven, you're ostracised. But don't worry, I have a foolproof method that'll ensure you'll never end up wasting your time. Find yourself a wooden spoon and stick a line on it, about a centimetre and a half. And as soon as you kind of have enough water up to that line, that's about right. When you get it right every single time, you can almost pat yourself on the back and say, I did that again. Give it a stir and simmer until the rice absorbs all the water. I've got three little kids. We live on salmon. This is the kind of stuff that we have in the house all the time. This is uber fresh farmed Scottish salmon, so I'm not even going to cook it. Because we're eating this raw, I like to have small chunks. Otherwise, it just feels like you're eating raw fish. Is that weird? You can see that there's no water left. Leave that to steam for about 10 minutes and then that gives me loads of time to crack on with the rest of the dish. Next, my simple dressing. I'm going to make this dressing out of stuff that I have in the cupboard all the time. So I'm going to start off with some mayonnaise. I'm going to add sriracha. This chilli sauce will give it a spicy boost. Some soy sauce. It smells so good. A bit of sesame oil, not too much because that's quite strong. Fish sauce. Oh, that's so fishy. Lemon juice. And then give that a little mix. And just to finish it off, just a little bit of black pepper. I say a little bit of black pepper. I like a lot of black pepper. If you're going to dress your salmon, dress it well. Look at that. Mm. Even when you're flagging, this is so easy to put together. And bonus, you get to use up all those nagging little leftovers knocking around in your fridge. I've always got spring onion. I'm not even going to bother getting a knife out. I'm just going to just use my scissors. My number one hack for making quick work of chopping. I've always got this odd carrot. Not enough to make a carrot cake, not enough to do anything else with. So this is perfect for something like this. As a simple shortcut to the authentic flavour of sushi, I'm just going to roll up these sheets of dried seaweed and give them a snip. Now I'm going to just check on the rice and you can see, look at that. That's what sushi rice is all about and that's what makes great sushi is because the rice all sticks together. Season it with some salt, sugar and then some vinegar. That smells so good. This is it, I'm ready to put my bowl together and all in about 15 minutes. Your rice is almost like the canvas. No matter how tired you are, take time to create something beautiful. I always have pickled red cabbage. Look at that colour. What's not to like? This recipe isn't about cooking. It's about piling on your favourite ingredients and making it special. Oh, there's something about that creamy goodness that you get from peanuts. Oh, I love it. Some sesame seeds. Just a bit of black pepper, because I think salmon likes black pepper. Food shouldn't look like art, but when it does, you kind of almost don't want to eat it, but I'm going to eat it. My salmon poke bowl, a tasty streamlined supper that will lift your spirits as well as bank you precious time. I have to put them down because they're slowing me down. No two mouthfuls are the same. <laughs> they taste different every single time. After a long day at work, sometimes dinner is the last thing on your mind. But in 15 minutes, I've just cooked up some rice and put some stuff together. And we've got this beautiful, beautiful dish that tastes out of this world. Now, if you don't mind, could you leave me with my bowl?